Intelligent and connected vehicles are paving the way toward the next generation of cars, trucks, and crossovers. However, intelligent vehicles must also be safe vehicles. Active safety technologies such as lane departure warning and side blind zone alert are available on many new cars today. These technologies not only provide real safety benefits to consumers, they are the building blocks that will someday enable automated, semi-autonomous, and fully autonomous driving. It's difficult to say when the technology is going to be good enough to be a completely autonomous vehicle, but the exciting thing is that these technologies are getting really good today, and so we're able to bring them into the marketplace as they're proven. The next level of active safety features, those that can intervene on the driver's behalf to help avoid or mitigate collisions, are being researched here at the brand new active safety test area on the General Motors Proving Ground outside of Detroit. The active safety test area is important to General Motors because we want to be a leader in active safety and crash avoidance technologies. So we need a place to test these systems, simulate the real world, and make sure we get it right before we put the systems out on the road. Front pedestrian braking, surround vision camera, and city speed front automatic braking are all being developed for GM's latest global cars and trucks. Automatic braking takes place in conjunction with the collision warning feature. So the system will alert you if you're approaching a vehicle too quickly. And then it also has the capability, if, if you're not able to respond with braking, to apply braking for you. Vehicles like the 2016 Chevrolet Malibu will be available with many of these crash avoidance technologies, with many more to follow. I'm Chris Hansen.